guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you everything I've been loving in September. First thing is these shoes. These are just a pair of little black ankle boots. And they're little like leathery type style. And they're pretty high actually. I don't usually wear heels this high. I don't know lengths, but this is like pretty decent but they're also pretty wide at the bottom so they're actually like not gonna make me fall over so that's exciting <laughs> i don't know where they're from actually because they're a gift but yeah they've got a nice long zipper on the inside and then a little buckle right here it doesn't actually buckle but just for like style and it's got like a slit in the back behind where the buckle strap is, so that's pretty cute. And what's next? Oh, I've been really into rolling coins lately because I had a huge pile of like coins and stuff that were just like sitting in a jar and I was like, you know what? Like, this is money. I need to like make this money money. So, got some fancy little coin wrappers. I ordered more actually because I'm out of all the penny ones right now and of course that's the coin that I have the most of but yeah if you guys don't know what these are pretty much so like this is the quarter one so if you have like a bunch of quarters laying around you like count out and it says like how many are on here so like ten dollars worth of quarters so you like count them all out and then you just like drop them in this little tube and then like fold up the end and then you can like take them to the bank and they'll like put it in your account so that's pretty cool if you have like coins laying around and stuff because I like pretty much never ever buy anything in cash anymore. So it's like I don't need coins and if they're like pennies especially like nobody likes to use pennies. So yeah these things are pretty ingenious. They make kinds where they're like completely flat and you have to like fold up the bottom and the top but these have like a firm like they're like firmer at the bottom so they like stay round so they're a lot easier to use I'd say. What else? Alright, let's move on to food because it wouldn't be one of my favorites without food. Okay. First thing is Velveeta Bites. I don't remember if I've ever talked about Velveeta before but if I haven't I don't know why I haven't because I literally have been obsessed with this brand for months but I'm always like trying the like, different things that they have so it doesn't even feel like I've been eating the same thing for months because I just always end up trying something different but it's always the same brand that I go back to all the time. So this is actually the Velveeta Bites and that's been my latest obsession and I think the most common one is probably the like Velveeta like breakfast biscuits so this is just kind of like a whole packet of like itty bitty biscuits. So they're super great to eat for a snack at like work or something and I just love any kind of breakfast that's like super easy to eat but like doesn't require silverware or like you can eat it while you're like doing other stuff. So they're just like little packets like this and they're so good. This is the cinnamon brown sugar flavor but they also have a mixed berry version of this which is also really really good. Kind of embarrassing but ramen specifically pork ramen i've been obsessed with ramen lately and i don't know why it's the most random thing ever i always used to make it in the microwave and it wasn't that good but then i started making it on the stove which is like what the actual like package directions are but i also put like half a tablespoon of butter in while i'm cooking it and it is just amazing but no so I've been this summer, specifically pork ramen, so just like the regular like packet ramen stuff. And then there's also this, it's called Taste of Asia Hearty Pork Flavor Tonkatsu Ramen. So this is by the same brand as like the regular ramen, but it's like in its own little bowl and you just put water in and stick it in the microwave or you can pour like already boiled water in there and just like let it sit but I love that it's in its own little bowl and it's got like corn and peppers and then it, 
<laughs> it's got corn and peppers in it, so it's like, it tastes a little bit more like real than the other ramen, but this stuff is so, so good. And I know that um, in these like bowl Taste of Asia ones, they have a couple different flavors, but the pork one is definitely my favorite by far. And my last food thing is the brand Food Should Taste Good. It's a very long name for a brand, but yeah, that's what the brand is called. There are these multi-grain tortilla chips from Costco. And <laughs> it's kind of amazing, but this bag is completely empty right now because I bought a bag and it was so good. We just finished the whole thing and I was like, oh, I know I'm going to want to talk about this. And my September favorite, so we bought another bag and then we finished the whole thing. <laughs> so, yeah, I would definitely, definitely recommend these. They're so good. A little bit healthier than tortilla chips. So, I've got black seed, sesame seed, and quinoa in them. So, I feel like they don't really taste like chips, they taste more like crackers, but like an extra thin, extra crispy cracker. And I am a huge fan of any kind of dip, so any kind of like healthier thing I can have with dip is always a plus in my life. These are also vegan and gluten free if you guys care about that at all. What else? Oh, I've been loving watching Modern Family. I feel like that show is so underrated. Like I used to watch it a long time ago, just like random episodes that were like come on at my gym all the time but lately I've just been like re-watching the whole thing like starting from the beginning and I'm already on like season seven and I'm like how is everyone in the world not like obsessing over the show it's so so good it kind of reminds me of friends in a way where it's just like a show where you don't necessarily have to watch the episodes in order like any episode you can just kind of like pick up and like know what's happening but it's like more meaningful if you like watch them in order. But I feel like Friends, it's like, it's not even like you can pick up from like any episode. It's like any, any point in that episode. And I feel like Modern Family has like really good plots and it's so funny. And it's so deep sometimes too. Like, I don't, I don't know. It's so good. I feel like I don't, I don't know why more people don't watch that show. I'm like obsessed with it now. It's like, pretty much all that I watch. So, yeah. What else? I haven't been really listening to any podcasts this month. I usually talk about like podcasts I'm listening to, but I haven't been listening to any this month. Let's see. Oh, I have one more favorite. It's my fresh friend over here. It's there. I got a bunch of these little baskets and they're actually just from Walmart, but they're so cute. I'm like dying. So this just has a bunch of my like lotion and like scissors and lip balm, Vaseline and like random like dressery type stuff in it. But I have another one of these in blue in my downstairs bathroom. I have another one of these in purple in my upstairs bathroom. And I am just like obsessed. They're literally just from Walmart. It was like less than a dollar for each of them. And it's so cute. It looks kind of like a crate but it's just like an itty bitty crate so yeah super cute that's all I've got for you guys so make sure you comment down below and tell me what you've been loving this month and also let me know if you've noticed anything different with my quality because I got a new camera so if you haven't watched my unboxing video make sure you do that as well and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys